All right, what's up, guys? We're in the shop again today, and uh, hey, Jay. So we've made some progress. Uh, we got got into a pretty good start this morning, and then later after lunch, we did not get to finish what we were doing. But anyway, we did finish the tongue and groove uh, joinery on these doors, so we can put these together. And we also got the tongue and grooves for these, these are the styles for the lowers. So you can kind of see there's the groove and then there's the tongue. So uh, that will fit and there's Jay yawning in the background. <laughs> <laughs> so we got that done. We also got the uh, drawer slides, uh, runner, excuse me, drawer runners cut and glued together. We have not cut those to length, but Got that done, so that's one more step out of the way. And then we were cutting the uh, panels. Panels, lost my words. Cutting the panels, and so all the stock is here. And we got one panel cut, which I'll open it up and let you look at it. So there's a, a nice book match. Now, all of that won't be shown in the panels. Jay, you mind showing them about how much? Yeah, so we're gonna remove about this much on each side. So, uh, and, and there's also gonna be a, a center style. These boards will not be glued together. There'll be two floating independent boards separated by a style. The style I just showed you will be in the middle, yeah. Yeah, so we're gonna get, we're, we're gonna get a little bit of this cathedral. That's not gonna be the, bit, the end of the world. We'll, we're primarily trying to focus on as much of the straight grain as possible. Yeah. And anytime that we are just forced to include this, just based upon the lumber that we have available, we'll do so in a manner that has some symmetry involved to where it doesn't just look lopsided. There'll be two panels side by side, and the symmetry will really play off one another. Yeah, I actually thought this was going to have a lot more figure in this, but... Well, I don't think that... Uh, I think it's still got quite a bit of figure. It's just... Depending on what board you're looking at, what angle, yeah. we've got some curl going on, and just about all these. Not a crazy amount, but we do have some. Yeah, there's a little bit. I don't know. It's just I thought. I guess I was expecting a little bit more, but it's going to turn out good. It's going to look really good, I think, especially with the book match uh, and separated by that style on the panels. So, still excited about it. Yeah, and then on, on the other side of the the uh, style along the entire perimeter of the panel, we're also gonna have some accent wood moldings. Oh yeah, I forgot about so that. Gonna be, it's gonna break gonna it up be, quite yeah, a bit. There's gonna be enough going on to where, uh, you know, not having 100% straight grain isn't gonna affect anything. It's gonna look great when it's all said and done. Yeah, once you show him, uh, show him what happened as we, we finished this one, then we went to do something else, and then this happened. Blade broke. So not the end of the world, but kind of put a damper on our progress because we were wanting to have the panels cut and everything assembled in a dry assembly today. Yeah. That would have been great. That would have been nice to see. Unfortunately, well, stuff happens and uh, I don't have a backup. Lesson learned, should have a backup on hand. Yeah, well, you don't, I guess you don't have a backup uh, resaw blade, but we do have another blade we could use potentially. Oh, yeah. Well, yeah. But we, Jay got one ordered in. We should get back, back into business first thing whenever we start again. So anyway, that's all we've done for today. I think we're going to call it there and pick up uh, again the next day, whether that's tomorrow or next Monday or whatever. Tomorrow or Monday, depending on uh, our scheduling stuff. Yeah. So anyway, that's it for today. See you tomorrow. Later.